We normally manufacture our cylinder brushes to mount snug on a customer's shaft. This usually means that the inside diameter of a brush will be slightly undersized by approximately 10 thousandths compared to the shaft. If the brush is made to the exact dimension of the shaft, it would be more of a slip fit and not appropriate for a brushing application. The procedure for mounting is always the same, but the brush face and brush ID will determine the difficulty. To slide the brush on the shaft, hold both ends of the brush and twist the brush in opposite directions to slightly open the ID. Once the brush starts on the shaft, a screwing motion along with opening up the ID will most likely be required. Once the brush is in place, hold one end of the brush and tighten from that end towards the other end. This procedure will take out any slack and keep the brush from moving when in use. However, the brush still needs to be secured to the shaft. Some brushes can be made with mounting clips which can connect the brush to the shaft either by a weld, clamp, or fastener. Depending on the use of the brush and the brush environment, it is possible to use epoxy, shaft collars, or J-bolts to secure the brush. However, the most popular mounting method is welding. Please keep in mind if this is your choice, be careful not to melt the filaments of the brush. Excessive melting could result in brush failure. Using a MIG or TIG welder is suggested. There are many applications in almost an infinite range of brush specifications, so there is no one-size-fits-all procedure. Precision Brush has manufactured tens of thousands of cylinder brushes. Most are mounted by our customers. However, we can also mount the brush on customer shafts if desired.